Meteorologist Rob Perillo. Welcome back. Well, just lovely weather across the area today. If you like today, you're going to have no issues with tomorrow's and more than likely Monday's forecast change on the way as we head into Tuesday. Quite toasty and then a front on the way. It gives us a little bit of relief for a day or so. More on that in just a bit. First off, big pictures. We look at the water vapor imagery. We see our next weather maker and yep, it's all the way out here in the Northeast Pacific off the coast of British Columbia, Canada. This will eventually bring a cool front through the area that'll uh, deliver some showers, but we're not looking at severe weather. We're not looking at a heavy rain, so that is the good news. High pressure pretty much in charge, a lighter flow, not much of a subtropical jet stream, and if anything, you see our winds aloft out of the west-northwest, so that's a dry flow for us. So relatively quiet weather, just a few clouds across the area during the course of the day and this evening, and we'll see that going into uh, tomorrow as well. Some, as we showed you earlier, late night, early morning clouds, but mostly sunny for the afternoon. Here's the European model and you'll notice temperatures into the mid 80s. Check out Laredo coming in uh, Monday afternoon at 101. Can summer be far behind there? And we're going to stay on the warm side, pushing the upper 80s. Laredo there 103. So uh, we're going to get a west southwest wind ahead of a frontal boundary that will deliver some showers to the area Tuesday night, ending early Wednesday morning and then back to a nice weather pattern and uh, a relatively dry pattern for not only the last part of Wednesday, Thursday, Friday as well. Next frontal boundary arrives Friday night into early Saturday, and that should cool us off a little bit again. Nice weather again for the latter part of next weekend. And one of the interesting things I noted earlier today, as we have been uh, looking at uh, all the moisture in the atmosphere, there's our front right here as we head into early uh, Wednesday or late Tuesday night, then dry, and then here comes that secondary front we showed you for the weekend. Uh, but down the line, we do see tropical moisture beginning to escape the, the intertropical convergence zone getting in the Gulf of Mexico. So this means there may be some tropical showers in our future some two weeks down the road and perhaps a fundamental change in the pattern. But for now, enjoy what we have. Mid 60s tonight, tomorrow low to mid 80s. Tomorrow night a little bit milder and then as we head into your uh, Monday we'll see temperatures well into the middle 80s for sure. So a very pleasant evening overall. Not quite as cool. Some clouds moving in by tomorrow morning. 64 the low 84 the high tomorrow. That's two degrees warmer than what we saw today with morning clouds and sun giving way to mostly sunny skies and a touch warmer and another breezy afternoon. Mid 80s your high as we head into Monday as well. Upper 80s, maybe 90 in a few spots on Tuesday with that westerly wind. Then a little bit of a cool down. We'll see 50s again a couple of nights in that 10 day forecast, but up and down temperatures for a while and no big weather makers. And that is the great news. That's it for weather for right now. We'll be right back right after this.